This is my house starting today. I was going to be a college student starting this spring. I, Ayushi Oda, was at a certain dorm. I moved from the countryside and my parents are poor, so I have almost no allowance. All the money I saved up for my part-time job disappeared in preparation for college and I found a cheap place to live. This is where I ended up. I don't know if I'm going to be good enough for a manager. This place is in rough shape. I barely had no money left in savings, so I had to find part-time work quickly. Working as a building manager here was a job I happened to stumble into. I would live in the building while maintaining the property. It would cut my rent in half while being paid. Talk about killing two birds with one stone. It wasn't that good of pay, but I could just find another job, so... Hello, I'm the new manager of these dorms. Oh? Huh? What? Why are you guys in towels? Oh, we were all going to go take a bath. Are you the new building manager? You look like you're around our age. I'm 18 and starting college this spring. Um, are you not embarrassed? Why? I'm a guy. Why are you the new building manager? I passed the interview. This is a dorm for girls only. Huh? I'm the one that's shocked. I mean, you look kind of feminine. That's probably why they screwed up, but... Are you sure you don't want to run away? What do you mean? Uh, this girl is called Rinka Kinoshita, and she's a junior, but... M man, and he looks kind of like he's into older women. A ladies' man. Huh? Whoa! Too late. Rinka Sana pounced on me like she lost all humanity. Well, let go! It's fine. No, it's not. It's not like you're going to lose something by hugging me. Come on, let's have a little fun. What are you talking about? She finally calmed down and we headed to the living room. There were three people living in this dorm other than me and they are all women. We all introduced ourselves and I found out that they attend an old girls university nearby. So you were hired because of your name and looks are kind of pansexual? Yeah, for sure. They only leased this place out to students so they probably didn't have a strict selection process. Yummy. Um, Alice, Yuki, sophomore, and Mia Orgura? Junior high, right? I think I'm gonna call the management company. No, definitely not. Huh? I don't know what Rinka is thinking, but you definitely shouldn't do that. Why? Your family is poor, right? And you don't have any money saved up. You're going to have a real tough time finding a place to live this cheap around here. The rent is pretty expensive considering it's a college town. I agree, and it's not your fault either. Yeah, if you work here, then you get paid and you get 50% off of your rent. If they find out, you just pretend like you didn't know. I couldn't say no to their evil suggestions. That's how my life as a building manager started. After I started college, I looked for a lot of jobs that I could do from home while studying, but... <sighs> Rinka san down! Mark, I'm not a dog. You've been looking over here for a while. What did you want? Are you some dog in heat? What do you think I am? I think you're a pervert with a fetish for younger boys. Uh, you're not wrong, but it's kind of sad when you hear someone else say it. If you don't have anything you need with me, get out. I'm busy. Well, wait, hang on. I just have something I want to talk to you about. Is that okay? Okay. You can't ask the other two. Yeah. Okay, then. It's Rinka Sam, though, so I'm unsure it's nothing serious. Or so I thought. It's about love, huh? Well, I don't have much experience, so I can't really give you much advice, but do you like someone? No, it's not that. I just haven't really been in love, and I'm this old, you know? Huh? Yeah, I know. Surprising. Huh? I'd always been going to all girls' schools. I never had any interaction with boys, so when I thought about the future, I was worried if a perv like me could find someone special. You don't need to worry. Huh? You're pretty as long as you keep it in your pants. I think you're definitely a hit. It's weirder if you aren't popular. P pretty Me? Yeah, let's try taking off your glasses. Oh. See? You are cute and beautiful, Miss Rinka. Huh? What's wrong? Why's your face so red? Oh, it's nothing. I'm sleepy now, so I'm going to go back now. See you! Rinka-san took my glasses that were in my hand and flew out of the room. What did they do? Rinka-san wouldn't even look at me from the next day. 
She would just flee when she ran into me. Shiota-kun, did you do something to Rinkachan? No, not really. Here you go. Thanks for always going out grocery shopping for us. Thank you for all your cooking. Thank you all for cooking great food for me. I'm really able to focus on my studies thanks to you. Th that's You guys are all lovey first thing in the morning, huh? Miyosan? We're not lovey at all. Oh, she ran away. It's your fault. You had to tease her. Sorry. So, are you free tonight? Yes. I have something to ask you. Okay, sure. What was she going to ask me? Miyosan came up to my room after dinner. She smelled really good after her bath. I was nervous. Uh, um, uh, what was it that you wanted to talk to me about? I heard Rinka asked you about love and romance. Y yes, and did something happen? Well, I'd like to talk to you about love and romance. Oh, uh, okay, sure. I was a little drawn to Miyosan that looked a little like a prince. She was also fidgeting, looking a little embarrassed. She told me her worries. In other words, you want people to think you're a cute girl? Y yeah, exactly. As you can tell, I'm super popular with girls. It's nice, but I'm interested in boys. Why does it matter? You need to stop worrying about it. You don't need to be cute or cuddly. But, but then boys won't like me. I'd like to find my first love and a, a boyfriend. Hmm, you know, I don't have much romantic experience, but I think you're attractive just the way you are. There might be guys that like cute girls and some that like badasses. It just depends on the person. Others might think that you're badass, but others might think you're cute. R really? Yeah. By the way, I think you're cute. What? Oh, nothing serious or anything. I just think you're attractive as a girl. You look good and you're pretty. And I like how hard you work. I enough. That's enough. I've never seen Miyosan embarrassed in the short time that I've been around her. I continue to talk to her and compliment her to tease her. I think you're very cute. Oh yeah, how about you try wearing cute clothes sometimes? I think you'd look good in sporty clothes. Enough. S sorry. I think I might have gone too far. She's mad now. Well, that's all I have for tonight. Thank you for all of your help. By the way, you like the sporty look? Well, it all depends. I think if it looks good on the person, I like it all. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. I was confused at how she was acting and what she was saying, but that was the end of the conversation for now. A few weeks passed by and I was invited to the aquarium. I don't know how long it has been since I've been. I think I went once when I was a kid. Aren't they a little late? Is there even a point in meeting up at the location? I didn't understand and I was a little worried that they might have been involved in an accident, but then... S sorry for being late. I, I just had to get ready a little bit. Are you mad? No, I just showed up, so don't worry. What's wrong? Do I look funny? Not at all. If anything, I think you're more attractive than usual. R really? <laughs> I looked at all three of them again, and they really do look great. It's insane that they've never had any partners. Ayukun, we dressed up too. Compliment us. Yeah. You two look great too. Thank you. <laughs> We walked into the aquarium. A lot of people were looking because there were all three beautiful girls following me around. They must have mistaken the situation a little bit, but we had a lot of fun. You two are a little close, don't you think? You think so? This is pretty normal, I think. That's not fair. The dolphins are so cute. You like dolphins? Yeah. Alison looks incredibly happy. That's rare. Thank you for today. I had a lot of fun. Thank you for coming out with us. We all just wanted to go out together. You moved in and we haven't really celebrated you joining us, you know? I think it was a great memory. I hope you had fun too. Let's all go somewhere too. After that, we went out more frequently with each other on the weekend. The more time we spent together, the more we grew closer. One day during the week, there was a guy that came to the dorm. Are you the building manager, Chiyotakun? Uh, yes, that's me. I'm from the company that manages this building. I have to talk to you. Would it be all right if I come inside? Uh, yeah, sure. I could tell that they probably figured out I was a boy. I knew they would come eventually, but I was a little sad. Just being blunt with you, you're a man, right? Yes. 
It's our fault for not catching this in all the paperwork or interviews, but this building is for women only. Would you be able to leave immediately? We will pay you for all of the money that you worked for, and we will help you find another location delivered to really great price. <sighs> okay, then. Wait a second. Can you not kick him out of the building, please? Rinka-san? Mio-san? I can't do that. It's against the rules. We've already talked to the owner of the building, and they said that they wanted the building to be only females so that the tenants can feel comfortable. But we're living comfortably now. Ayu still hasn't... Uh, no, I guarantee you he's not weird like that. But still... Thank you both so much for all of your help, but as long as it's rules, we can't just ignore it. So I'm gonna leave. But... I lived here for a short time, but I had such a great time. We won't be able to live together, but that doesn't mean we can't see each other. Let's just go somewhere on the weekend again. Are you? Are you cool? I'm sorry for everything to all of you. Are you free right now, Shiotakun? Yeah, I don't have any plans for today, so I'm good. Could you come by the office real quick? I need you to sign some paperwork and whatnot. Okay, sure. This is how my life here was coming to an end. I was just about to leave with the management company employee when... Wait, hang on. Alison, what's wrong? Why are you so out of breath? Uh, are you the management company worker? Y yes, that's me. Uh, I'm the daughter of the owner. My name is Alice Yuki. I've convinced my father to reverse the policy on this building, so I'd love you to return to the office to confirm. Okay, but... Take him with you. Uh, Alice? Rinka-chan, Mio-chan, it's fine. Shiota-kun will come back. Uh, okay then. Afterwards, I talked to the management company owner directly, and after getting consent from the other two in the building, I was able to continue living in the building. When I was leaving, the owner said something about take care of my daughter, but what did she tell him exactly? Whatever the case, everything was settled and daily life returned to normal, but... Um, guys, why are you so close to me? There's plenty of places to sit. No, we're restocking on Ayukun energy. Yes, if we don't have that energy, we won't be able to move. Yeah. What are you guys talking about? I have work after this, so I'm gonna go. Wait, hang on. Are you trying to abandon us? Don't go. Mm, they've kept this up for the past few days. Did they eat something weird? You know, I think you work too much. Huh? You won't be able to really relax if you're only going out on the weekends. That's true. He's always doing something when he moves. So? W what are you doing? You need to rest when you're tired. I'm not tired. Let go of me. Nope. I'm going to spoil you today. But... You've got an easy part-time job, right? We'll help you out when you need it. I want to sleep on his lap. I'm next. What the heck? What do you think I... Uh... You're an important person to us, Ayukun. We're going to share you, so you better be ready. Yeah. What are you talking about sharing me? I was now being secretly shared amongst my roomies. I had fun every day at the dorms, but I don't know how long this is going to last. Thank you for watching. How was today's video? Please check out our other videos as well.